Welcome back to a new Boomwitch video guys. We are here in four end rooms. We've climbed all the way up to rank 17 and 31 stars. If we take a look at the logs, the log is almost perfect except for this one attack. I'll show you the attack strategy I've been using so far. So it's practically been, I'll just show you the latest one over here. So I've been doing the smoky flare uh, attack strategy. So I've been smoking my troops to the corner of one of these ender rooms and basically been collecting an end room that way. So let's go to X speed over here. Over here there was a little bit of an issue over here with the sky shield. Very difficult to flare under that so we did our best. This is how we did it. I'm using the rifleman and the zookas because that's what I've got unlocked. And I've upgraded the smokes so they last a lot longer and also the flares last a lot longer as well. So you see over here I'm using the remote hack, I'm shocking the splash damage buildings and then we're just able to take out one or two end rooms. If they're close by we can take out two end rooms and that's how we're getting our uh, chests. So there we were, luckily in this space we were able to get three, three end rooms and we were able to, by we were able to bypass all these uh, defenses. So that was lovely. You know at this point you know even just collecting you know one end room is very difficult so just getting one or two is very very good it puts it puts us in a good position to win the battle and as you can see from our attack log it's been going pretty well the only reason we we didn't win this one is because the base was like this it was a lot more spread out you know i could have flared over here smoked my troops and gotten one end room but i thought that this base i would have been able to handle it using just tanks and I went ahead with the tank strategy. You can see over there are all tanks. And unfortunately for me, it didn't work out. My tanks simply fizzled. Um, I wasn't able to keep them alive. I faced the doom cannon. The even the hot pot there was uh, was taking out my tanks. I was luckily able to get one end room there because I flared flared back down. But the other end rooms I simply couldn't get. If we had been able to take out that Doom Cannon there, we might have been able to get those two end rooms, but unfortunately the rock launchers were doing quite a number of damage on us. So that's the only, re uh, only reason I lost that attack. The rest of these attacks have pretty much been the way I've been talking there. So this one, it seems I decided to use tanks there, and then I'm delay dropping the Rifemen just to provide some coverage for the tanks to do the damage. So they're hacking the hacking the boom cannons. If you can hack the boom cannon, because they do a lot of damage to the other defensive buildings and they have a relatively good amount of health as well. So if you can hack those, the doom cannon also the boom cannon, they will provide a lot of value there. So that's that attack there. And let's show you one of these attacks. Let's, let's go to this one. Okay, so this is a typical four end rooms uh, base you might come across right now. And this is the way we attack this. So let's go 2x speed over here. So we're dropping the flare and we're dropping the smokes on our, on our troops. Rifleman and Zuka. So let's start to battle speed up there. Okay, so it seems we took a long while to spectate the base before we start to try, try down our troops so there you have it smoking our troops we do lose a lot of zookas there because of the flame chore but luckily we have enough riflemen to destroy that single end room and then we tried to go hail mary for the for the next end room but unfortunately there wasn't enough enough firepower there so let's take a look at one of these ones so 43 so this was uh, damage percentage Okay, so we're dropping down the critters to take out the mines. Luckily the mines were all clustered so literally just one uh, one critter will take them all out So there's all our troops going. I am going to switch the riflemen out for Heavies because they will hopefully last a bit longer against all the rocket launcher damage and even the single shot damage there as well So you see there I'm delay dropping in this space, the reason I didn't flare underneath one of the sky shield or right next to an end room is because I thought that I'd be able to take out the 
base just by shocking this area over here because that's all the splash damage in his base the rest of his base doesn't really have too much splash damage it's simply the re regular machine gun machine gun damage and i thought just by shocking the three rockets back there our zookas would have enough firepower to speedily take down the rest of his defenses but unfortunately you know the rockets we simply didn't have enough gb to back up our troops there and one by one our uh, troops fell and the doom cannon is still up there as well we bought one boat of uh, tanks there i don't know why but i guess we just did and the tanks even the tank was not enough to uh, go up and even take out one engine there so luckily on percentage we won that and let's take a look at a defense i guess let's start looking at defenses well it's not too surprising uh, we all know how how these attacks typically go let's go for x speed right there he's bringing a couple of grenadiers to take out the mines and some tanks so the doom cannon still coming at a destroying his troops from the side and then we've got two boom cannons right there and nice amount of splash damage and single shot buildings uh, placed all around the base so there it is right there so that's all we were able to do let's take a look at the tech tree now we are going to unlock i'm going to unlock the heavies because when i do the flaring and the smokes i want to use heavies and zookas hopefully the heavies will last a lot longer than the riflemen and i'll be able to destroy more bases and more end rooms that way so i won't swap them out for the heavies just yet because the heavies are only level two uh, we're on a lovely 7x win streak so let's try and get that going okay this base let's see he's got i can get this one engine i can guarantee myself that one engine if i flare over there He's got two engines over there and then one engine back there. Uh, pretty spread out. Um, so he's got some shock mine, but they shouldn't be too much of a wor uh, worry. Yeah, okay. So I'm ready. So I'm going to drop down some critters at the start. Drop all our troops. Let's start flying down here. Flares do last a long time now. So that's going to be good. And just... We're going to wait a second. There, right there. Right there. And double. And we will have to do a reflare, but that's okay. And now we're only using two flares instead of like six that we were using before. Hopefully the troops will build to... Right there. Okay, there's a lot of rock launcher damage. Okay, we will get one. I don't think we will get two. Can we flare up there? I'm not sure if we can because it is a pretty long distance. And the rocket, the rocket launchers are going to be hitting us from the back. Yeah, we probably won't be able to. Uh, but even, look, we got one and he retreated, guys. So that was good enough for us. Let's just, uh, all of our troops are going to die here. Let's just, um, I guess let's just retreat. I don't have instant training, so I've got to wait for all these troops to come back up. That's the thing with these attacks right now at four end rooms. Every single time you do an attack, all your troops are going to die. Um, that is unless you retreat there, but... Yep. So now we're on an 8x win streak. That's lovely. And you can see here it's difficult to even get one end room. Okay, he's got rock choppers. And he tried to flare across. That's interesting. This is definitely a potential weak point in my base against rock choppers because I don't have any single shot buildings back there. I've got some in the front over here, but not back there. So I've got sniper towers which can reach the rock choppers even the machine gun does target air troops so a bit of coverage but not single shot coverage so let's collect that and i guess let's just do one more battle here while we're at it um we've got a nearly perfect log that's lovely to see 8x win streak fingers crossed we can keep it going and get into rank 21 okay this one hopefully we can get two end rooms over here he does have splash damage buildings right there, so we will have to shock over here. And he's got mortar there as well. Okay, the rock launchers are nicely spaced out as well, so I might have to throw down critters or um, shock. So what I'll do is, I'll have to throw down a shock over here, I guess. And then perhaps one over here, and then throw down some critters over here or something. You know, there's 
Um, I, don't, I don't even know if I have enough GB to throw down, throw down all these shocks and critters, but let's go. Okay, sorry guys there, I'm just really focusing hard there. Let's do... Okay, we're gonna hack that one. Let's sh shock, shock. Quitter is not gonna be enough. Let's try another hack. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. I don't think we have enough GB for um, the next one. I'm gonna flare to the next one as well. To try I'm gonna get greedy there. Uh, we don't have enough troops though, so we've only got riflemen up, but yeah. I think two is pretty good though, I think we got the win there. Oh no, I spoke too soon, he's got one. He's got one in the bag. Okay, that's it for me, I'm just gonna retreat right there. Okay, nice, fingers crossed, thank god. He's got, he retreated. That's an 8x or 9x win streak, can't remember there. Let's look, take a look at the replay. Uh, tanks, he's got a small number of tanks. I, I guess he's trying to use the Grenadiers more on this attack because the base is quite clustered. Let's see how he goes. Does he have... Oh, he has a uh, Bombardier as well. I, they sometimes get mixed in with the Grenadiers. I can't even tell them apart there. But unfortunately, you know, the rockets came in clutch there against those troops. So there it is. One more attack and we would get a clear log. Uh, should we do it? It's quite long, long video, so I'm just going to stop it right there. Uh, there we are guys, 9x win streak, lovely to see that. That's it for today, don't forget to leave a like and, and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.